Okay. Need to update my stuff, guys. Give me just a second. Continue your adventure. <laughs> Here's what happened so far. With Hendrik and a horde of Heladorian soldiers, hot on their heels, Uljan and Eric have hurled themselves through the doors of departure and into the great unknown. While soaking in the steam baths of Hoto, they meet a lost little girl called Connie, and set out to help her find her family while searching. They meet another girl called Veronica, who's lost their sister somewhere. She says she's a skilled magic user from a place called Arborea, and that she was lucky enough, unlucky enough, to be spirited away by monsters. She managed to escape, but it seems her sister Serena was last seen setting off for the monster's den in an attempt to effect to effect a rescue. I never heard it done like that. Fearing for her safety, our hero... Look at this insanity. Fire Acid! 14 months, thank you so much, baby. Very, very, very much appreciated. Thank you so much. Uh, our hero and Eric agreed to join Veronica uh, in going after her. Okay, I need to update something really quick. Hopefully the alerts aren't too loud. But right now, I think everything was a little bit too low because I accidentally turned the system volume all the way low earlier. How's that? Is that too loud? I think it should be okay. Probably just a little bit too loud for me. There we go. And the sub alert should be a little bit more noticeable. They were a little low at first. All right. Let us continue, shall we? An inquisitive little lad from Cobblestone. Oh, I don't know what he just said. All right. Okay, so where were we headed? We were headed to the Hoto Step, which is, oh wait. Head for the Hoto Step and search for Veronica's sister in the cryptic crypt, which is that away. We had just forged some new weapons, guys. We're going to be hitting like a boss. And we already got what was up there. I wish we could get more out of there. Okay. We probably can't go left here. But we could try anyway. There's a chest here. Of course we don't have this dadgum key. We need a new key, man. Veronica, get your little booty in there and get that chest for us. I'm gonna just say it's Pokemon. What's Pokemon? This game? All right, the cryptic crypt. Here we are. Um, these are new. Uh, defense decreases. That ain't no good. Get him, Veronica. All right, Eric. Beautiful. Ouch. Oh my god, they hit like trucks. Look like Spore, but my chat was in disagreement with the plan. 
This just looks Another like Spore? I don't, I, don't, I don't see that. <laughs> this looks like Dragon Quest. Puts a green eye in the item bag for safekeeping. Mm. We might need to level up a little bit. Sap? Oh, okay. Uh, spells. Let's do seeds. Beautiful. Hit him with the boomerang, Eric. Yeah, that's pretty good. Ninety-two XP. Uh, that seems really, really good. Okay, let's go left first, because there's a shiny here. I knew it! A chunk of iron ore. What are you talking about, Skate? I'm confused. Yeah, it's Dragon Quest, Cass. These little groups ain't that bad. One or two at a time. Way better graphics, same old audio. Um, yeah, same, uh... Same music scores, just in a different way. Still have the sound of the stairs like in the old Dragon Quest, man. Like, <laughs> it's kind of cool. Alright. Like the attack sound is the same? Yeah. said easy peasy at least she didn't say lemon squeeze oh hello later tiny You're not bad at all our offense is on point I don't know about our defense yet Uh, what's our health and stuff like? Probably want to use some, um... So, apparently, she doesn't even take damage or anything. She's just kind of assisting us. Is there worms in my drink? Mm -mm. Doing good, Cass. How are you, bud? I don't like the fact that they attack a lot faster than I do. She doesn't take any damage right now, which is so weird. Was shocked when you said there's a worm in tequila, thought you was joking? No. <laughs> no. I'm not joking. <laughs> That's a regular thing. That is a regular thing. better? It's good to hear, guys. Can't neglect that old health, man. Can't Veronica neglect it. Wins again. I do it enough. I neglect health more than I should. 
You never gonna drink it? <laughs> God! 62, baby! Prints are sweet. Spooky mist. Yep, agave plant worms. Who else wants some? I worked at a Mexican restaurant for a long time, and uh, or a couple of them actually, and. There were plenty of uh, tequilas that we stocked. Oh my god! A trap! Okay. An Yggdrasil leaf. What can we do with that? Mm, it doesn't go in that. It doesn't go in that. Is it in Eric's pocket? No. Hmm. Where did it say it went? Oh, there it is. Returns a single fallen ally to life. Oh, wow. Neat. Lump wizards. Dude, them crits though. Ouch. Tight, naturally. That would be the big red line that symbolizes that. Uh... Hmm. Let's go in here first. Um, no. Here first. Anything? Any shinies? No. No shinies. Happy to report I'm not the only one that calls you shade. Did I did I not equip my new sword? Oh, I did not. What the hell is wrong with me? Thank you, monkey. I didn't I didn't oh my this sword is big. I didn't realize it wasn't even it wasn't equipped. How much you want to bet this is a trap? I knew it! Freaking knew it. Mm. 
is going to show me some past. Touch the, Yggd the Yggdrasil root, yes. What's up, Necro? shadow if it wasn't so long. I can't go falling into my own trap now, can I? What will the others say? Right, I'd better go the long way round. What a weird looking creature. This is telling me I have to take the long way around. I kind of find that out by default earlier. See, that's a trap right there. That's definitely a trap. And he went to... Or is this a trap? They're both traps! Guess what, though? Traps are good when you find feathered caps. Um... Yo, Gladius! Thank you for the three months in a row, homie. How you a doing? A stream to entertain me while I model a spooky demon thingy. Spooky Perfect. demon thingy. Mm. What sort of spooky demon thing are you working on? Pointy hat, feathered cap. Oh yeah. Give me some give me some strength. Okay. We can go Oh, there's zombies here. Oh, what is that over there? There's a mount. Y'all see it? Yes. Surprise! Boom, baby. I hit like a truck now with the sword. Gladius, in fact, is in fact the orc or P guy. Nice. Sweet. New spell learned. Evac. I thought... Oh, Eric learned Evac, too. Uh, can we afford anything? Great swords. MP cost four. Hella chopped it. No, it's seven points. I need more points. Ha-ha! <laughs> okay. Two chunks of gold ore. Chunk of iron ore. Oh. Oh, baby. Nice. Okay. Hmm. Let's go straight across right here. I knew we was gonna fall. But I should just be able to go right back up, huh? No. Maybe not. I'll post the model I'm working on in Discord if you want to see it. I'm honestly just bored. Not much to play at the moment. Gotcha. I don't guess you play any, like, competitive games, huh, Gladius? Like Overwatch or PUBG or any of that stuff. Here's the chest. Robber gloves? Oh, hell yeah. Yeah. 
equipment. Robber gloves. Gloves, uh, beloved of the beginner bandits that boost the deafness of the wearer. Hell yeah. I did, I did play those a lot. I'm good at them and was close to joining a pro team in CSGO, but too much work to maintain, so I don't play them. Yeah. Yeah, it's really, really hard to, um, to keep up an edge like that. Did I go in here yet? A mini meadow. I do have a PS4. The only time I ever really played those for competitive, uh, I mean, uh, competitive. For titles that uh, are exclusive. Oh! oh. I knew it. The other way was blocked too. Oh, let's go this way instead. Uh, back up this way. Still have two PS1s? <laughs> All right. I knew it. I'll clear them out all eventually, though. It's pretty fun riding around on it, though. <laughs> grew up on PS1. I grew up on uh, on Nintendo and Sega Genesis, but I played plenty of PS1. I used to play SSX Tricky. Hardcore, baby. And Roll Cage. Those was my jams. All right, how do we get around here? That's another pit. There, I already got it, apparently. There's an open chest. Uh-huh. That chest is not gettable. Unless for some reason there is a way to cross over that pit. I'm gonna do it, guys, one more time. Oh, it's not a, a a silver platter. Holy. It wasn't actually a trap. Can't believe. That's one heck of a fountain to be hidden away down here. Uh -huh. Boss time. What? Over there. I feel it. <laughs> In television, you mean, Kaz? Serena, wake up. It's me. Veronica. Hmm? That's your sister? Serena! We said we'd always be there for each other, didn't we? Well, I'm here for you now. So pull yourself together! It worked. <sighs> Finally, the fussing paid off. <sighs> she drooling? <laughs> she was drooling. Oh. I'm ever so sorry. It's just I... Oh, well, I was so awfully tired after all that searching that I needed a nap and... Veronica! It, is that really you? What in the world has happened to you? Who... But... How did you know it was me? <laughs> We've been sisters a long time, you know. It would take a lot more than a new look to fool me. Yes, very funny. What were you doing lying on the ground like that? I... I thought you were... Well, that you were... You know... <sighs> <laughs> Sorry to interrupt the reunion, 
But didn't oh, you tell us Serena I'm terrible was at it too, Gladys. Sister? <laughs> well, if you want to get technical about it, actually we're twins. But we don't look the same age anymore because, well, it's all a bit complicated. I told you I was taken off by monsters, didn't I? They've been kidnapping people so they can steal their magical powers. Well, I wasn't going to let them have mine without putting up a fight. But the more I resisted, the younger I got. I don't quite understand it, but instead of draining my magic, they drained my age. Then why didn't you use your magic all that time we was fighting down here? <sighs> what I'm basically saying is that I'm not a Pitfall, child. Man. So stop treating me like one. Okay, we get it, we get it. You're not a kid. But you still look like one. Don't you want to do something about it? <laughs> of course I do. Why do you think I brought you here? I want you to help me clobber those stupid monsters and see if we can fix this. You will help us, won't you? I promise to do my bit as well. I have some really rather wonderful healing spells, you know. All right, fountain. MP and HP completely restored. A strange voice echoes from afar. Oh, let's save, shall we? Yes. Demon attack. Demon attack was a great game for Atori as well. Uh, yes, we want to continue. Okay. Let's see what happened here. It's a little beastie. It's a little skeletal beastie. Kadumbra? That's your magic password? Yeah, where are you going, Gladius? What states are you visiting? None shall pass without the secret word. Umbra Kadumbra, baby. I gingerly pushed it open. Oh my. Pots! I see him. Massachusetts. Are you potty? You come here and tell Jarvis that you let that lovely, juicy specimen escape, and you think an apology's gonna cut it? Ooh, this jars. Do you crackpots think sorcerers like Veronica come along often? Do you have any idea what we'll have to do to nab a specimen like that again? <laughs> you knew I wanted to drain all her magic so I could earn the Lord of Shadow's respect when he came back. All my plans shattered. <laughs> the Lord of Shadows? That's them. They're the monsters who jumped me in the bathhouse and brought me here. See that jar by the big fat one? That's what he was sucking all my magic powers into. Then I guess we'd better figure out how to get them back. Uh-oh. Surprise! Huh? <laughs> I do love guests. <gasps> Trash. <laughs> Especially when they bring me presents. If it isn't the one that got away. Talk about hey, it. Hey, priest. How's it going, buddy? Yeah. 
just sit tight while we suck every ounce of magic out of you. You ain't gonna suck me, Jarvis. Please? This lot of earned a VIP treatment. No sucking. Uh, looks like we'll be fighting our way out of this one, whether we like it or not. <laughs> Let's fight, baby. <laughs> All right, fight. Oh. Spells, seers, the shadows. Oh. Fire! Oh. Cast crack. Oh. Serena, cast heals, baby. Oh my God, he hits for 26. Salad cream! Earn the VIP. <laughs> 21. Oh my god. Uh oh. This looks like it might hurt. Yeah, heal everybody. Cool breath. Ouch. That really hurt. Am I gonna need a heal? I think I do. He'd make a lovely bag or boots. Thank you, darling. Ouch. Ouch. They're almost dead. Much better. It's gonna be a lot easier to manage now. Bust him in his mouth! I need a crit, man. Yeah, we definitely, we would love to have that healer on our team. Ouch. As much as I don't want to, I got to. Ouch. Give me a crit, baby. Jarvis is pepped up now. This is gonna hurt bad. Pepped up! Let's do it, baby. Yes, heal me. Because we got a special to do. Pep powers the real decoy. Yep. Eight points of damage. The pep is real. Here you go, through. <laughs> Level 12. Yes, we want to use them right away. We can learn Helichopter now. Swipe at a group of enemies with the great swing of the sword. Yes, please. And now that opens up that question mark ability, which is cool. Uh, it takes how many points? This panel can now be unlocked. Take a look. Unlock panel. The hidden panel shadows revealing Frost Fang skill fires frosty projectiles at a group of enemies that can freeze them in a spot. Very nice. It takes 12 points to unlock that. <laughs> And Eric receives... I don't think you have enough to do. 
Increases attack power. Yeah, you need six. That's nine. Um, when wielding knives, that's a little bit different. We already got the steel ability, huh? Or no, this is a uh, pep power piece. Steals from an enemy. Uh, flame slash. That's for a sword. Dodge chance increased. Increased deftness. That's eight points. Yeah, you just need some more. More time. I'll never be the Lord of Shadow's right hand man if I can't even beat the likes of you lot. Ugh. All my dreams shattered. Who is this Lord of Shadows you keep mentioning anyway? <laughs> You'll find out soon enough when everything finally goes. To pot. To pot. We'll find out soon enough, huh? I mean, at least Jarvis is pretty ambitious until the end. <laughs> huh. Right. Time to get my magic back. What are you going to do? Eat it? Just open the pot and eat the magic? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You asked for it. Oh. 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 I hope this works. Oh. Yeah, Cobb. I did a uh, top three on my channel. And she's still short. But, you look just the same. We're all our efforts for nothing. Mainly, um, I, I really liked um, the look of um, the new one that's coming up from Ubisoft. It looked really good. And that horror one that I did. Need to worry on that front. I can feel the old magic zinging from the ends of my pigtails right down to the tips of my toes. But then why do you still look like a little girl? Oh. I'm not really sure. I suppose whatever made me younger can't be fixed just by getting my powers back. But it could be worse. Because I mean, it's YouTube. You know Cub. what they say. <laughs> You're only young. Twice. Hey, Tripso. Trust you to see the funny side. Well, I suppose I'd better get used to having a twin sister half my size. By the way, you have noticed who we're traveling with, haven't you? Of course I have. And so have you, it seems. Shall we? Mm -hmm. Oh. Bold luminary, Yggdrasil's chosen. Long have we waited to greet you. We of Arborea swear to protect you. While we live, none shall defeat you. Well. There are those who would accuse you of bringing disaster on Long our world. Long ago, Kirkinos. Please, you must rest assured that they are wrong. Yeah, I know that. You are a hero. The light in your eyes the light told of in the legends of Arborea. It proves that beyond a doubt. <laughs> I knew it was you the moment I saw you. So now you have magical twins swearing to serve and protect you? Yeah. I guess you really are the luminary, huh? Mm-hmm. Not that I ever doubted it, of course. Can I, can I get a massage now? There's plenty more we need to talk about, but we have to take care of something first. Yeah, long ago, before any expansions or anything came out, I played Don't Starve. I wasn't the only one they were keeping prisoner, you know. Now, if I remember rightly, there should be a door around here somewhere. Awarded for acquiring a total of at least 5,000 gold coins. Wow, I got a lot of money. 
Awarded for being recognized as a luminary by two twins from Morbury and trusted in ensuring your safety. Major twins sworn to protect you. Now that's something a guy could get used to, huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, okay, so we have to go here. But there may be stuff I could see first. Pots! Oh, I can't do that while mounted. Well, allow me to get off my mount then. Grubby bandage. No pots. Shiny. Iron ore. Like that's it. Oh wait, what the hell is that? Oh, that's my mount. Got you. I don't think I'll be able to keep it. Nope. Can you rename the short and Gosh, shiny one? Look <laughs> at all these cells. What a horrid place. Who's there? Don't worry, you're safe now. We took care of that potty old fathead potty. with cronies. Potty old fathead. <laughs> That's hilarious. Thanks. I Thanks. owe you one. I was starting to worry they were going to get sick of feeding me and decide to eat me instead. You were starting to worry? And what about your poor little daughter all on her own, hmm? How do you think she's been feeling? Oh, I'm sorry, I wasn't thinking. Wait, you know Connie? Yeah. We do. And she's fine, thanks for asking. The owner of the bar back in town is looking after her. He's a mature, responsible adult, you see. Oh, listen, I appreciate your help, really, I do. I'm Noah, by the way. If there's anything I can do to repay you, just say the word. Noah, huh? Where have I heard that name before? He built an orc? Oh, <laughs> I've taken up enough of your time. I should, uh, get back and see how uh, Connie's doing. <laughs> Thanks a million. Well, he certainly left in rather a hurry. You can say that again. Very fishy. Well, never mind. We should head back too. We deserve a rest. Agreed. And a foot rub from my servant twins. Zuljan and his companions make their way out of the labyrinth and head back to Hoto, where they spend the night at the inn. Then the morning comes. Yeah, it took me out of there, thankfully. I think we already checked all this stuff. Yep. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. Sorry about that. Finally, you wake. Your comrades rose long ago at morning's first light. Now they wait below. They wait for you to join them. And trees wait for spring. Aww. I know, Hunter. <laughs> Awake at last, huh? Don't worry, we all just woke up too. And now we're up. It's time to continue our little talk from before about Serena and I and how we're going to help you. Hmm. We have a legend in Arborea. It says that one day the Dark One will descend to extinguish the light, but that Yggdrasil's chosen, the Luminary, bearer of the Mark of Light, will rise to meet him. That's the plan, sweetheart. I know it's hard to believe. I mean, look at you. But it's true. You're the reincarnation of the Luminary, the man who defeated the Dark One long ago. I still can't work out why they'd need to bring you back if the Dark One was defeated, to be honest. But ours is not to reason why. 
Once we fulfill our sacred duty and get you to Yggdrasil, I'm sure all will be revealed. Yggdrasil, huh? Well, I for one want to know what the heck's going on. Let's mosey on over there. Let's just mosey on over to the Tree of Life. Have you ever tried thinking before opening your big mouth? <laughs> in case you hadn't noticed, Yggdrasil is floating in the sky. Mosey, he says. Honestly. <laughs> they say that the Luminary visited the World Tree before his battle with the Dark One. But alas, the legends do not tell us how. What? Not even you special protectors of the magical ancient wonder truths, no? Bummer. Yggdrasil, Yggdrasil, Yggdrasil. Wait, I think I might have an idea. Really? What is it? You know that guy we bust out of jail yesterday? I remembered where I know him from. He sells information to, uh, people in my profession. That's what I'm thinking, Ravenhope. You think he might know how we can reach the world tree? Wonderful. Well, what are we waiting for? To the bar. To the bar. Take the path down to the bar. Daddy, let's go. The nice man who keeps bringing you drinks must be getting tired. <laughs> uh, just <laughs> one more for the <laughs> road, sweet. <laughs> you never know. He might uh, have some hot gossip that I <laughs> need to hear. <laughs> Fishing for rumors, huh? Some things never change. Mm -hmm. You're Noah, right? In the circles I used to move in, you were pretty famous. You were the guy who knew things for the right price. No nugget of knowledge too big or too small. Yeah. Noah the know-it-all knows them all. That's what they used to say, huh? <laughs> what if Gladys, you got drunk before oh, RP? Nah. Juicy tidbits having a bit of falling in me lap now can i oh he's sobered up a lot well i don't go trying to get mixed up in this stuff it just happens like when i mistookenly went in the ladies baths and then monsters they kidnapped me i only stuck my head in there to see what all the commotion was and there they was attacking some poor girl normally i would have won up the lot of them of course but i just had me tea the villains collared the both of us and well i just hope she's all right why would your tea affect she... your fighting prowess kind of what kind of tea you was drinking homie? anyway we were wondering if you might be able to help us out some pity maybe <laughs> why do you know about interest <laughs> ah, some insanity he means dinner crikey you lot don't do things by us, do ya? God. On the way here, Connie and me was traveling across the desert. When we came down, we have a bad case of heat stroke. We didn't have no grub left, no water, nothing. Hey, we Trixie. just about <laughs> given up hope. But then, these soldiers from Galopolis came along. Hey, I think somebody just knocked at my door, guys. Hold on just a second.
It was my son. It was my son. He is looking for um, dress shoes. All right. Okay. What did I miss? Yeah, Raven Holt. Ha <laughs> Yeah, you're gonna be fine, Trixie. You're gonna be fine. All right. How old is he? He is 22. Uh, yes, I am doing Gunsmoke tonight, Beast. Um, probably in about 20, 30 minutes or so. We didn't have to go grub, no grub left, no water, nothing. Nothing. <laughs> we had just about given up hope. Then the soldiers from Gallipolopolis. Next thing I know, I'm waking up in the Sultan's Bleeding Palace. Oh, talk about lucky. Anyway, when I come to... That's when I seen it. Beautiful it was. This rainbow-colored branch thing. Oh, shimmery and beautiful. Beautiful. Well, I know top end gear when I see it. If that weren't a branch of the old world tree, I'm a monkey's uncle. Did you hear that, Veronica? A branch from Yggdrasil herself? Yes. Lighting the path ahead for the luminary. It sounds like we need to take a trip to Galopolis. Galopolis. So it turns out you are capable of having ideas that aren't completely stupid after all. Oh my god. <laughs> we should head for the desert right away. It's beyond the checkpoint southwest of here. That marks the border with Galopolis. I do hope you won't mind us tagging along. Absolutely not, sweetheart. Come on. We of Arborea swear oh. to protect you. They're doing While twin we thing live, again. none shall defeat you. <laughs> Galopolis the Jello King. <laughs> Thank you, Beast. I've been streaming um, Gunsmoke Here. almost every day, though. I didn't yesterday, but... A Galopolis Pass. The guards at the checkpoint are awful sticklers for formalities, but if you show them that, they should let us through. Well, thank you, sweetheart. Okay, so we got the Galopolis Pass, huh? Okay, so to get to Galopolis, leave the Hodo Step and head to the Sultanate of Galopolis. So we're going to. You know, we never went to Miko's Shrine. We should probably check that out before we go too far. How is Gunsmoke now? Um, uh, kind of the same. <laughs> it's fun. It's Gunsmokey. Uh, Rook protected us. His sword held the dragon back. Now he's no more. Miko lost her son. Now she must live with grief. Bleak as winter rain. I'm just interested in your pots. I can't go back here. Oh, mother's grief is private. Oh, I see. She's grieving. This is probably something that I have to deal with later. Leader of the townspeople, maiden of the shrine. Our home is humble, place the hot springs steal little happens here. Okay. No pots then, I see. Do you have pots back here though? Of course you do. All right, Pathfinder. I don't think I could go back here. Nope. 
All right, down we go. So, hey, they're in the party now. Veronica's staff, uh, hairband. We can give her a feathered cap plus two, which gives her some. Oh, actually, it's equipped. Never mind. Feathered cap is still better than what I have. Silk robe. Nothing. Fishnet stockings. I can wear these. Defense and charm. I like it. Um, actually, I think I might unequip that and put it on Serena because defense for her is going to be good because she's the healer, right? Silver platter gives her a hell of a shield. Holy crap. Look at that. Silver platter. <laughs> it's all about pot lids and stuff. <laughs> Hell yeah, baby. Because a kid shouldn't be wearing fishnet stockings. She's not really a kid, though. She's more like a small person. A little person. We have a little journey ahead of us, don't we, Zildjian? Well, I happen to know a handy little spell that makes it a lot easier for us. Just give me a minute. We learned Zoom. You could use this spell I'll taught you to travel back to anywhere you've been before, quick as a flash. So if you want to come back here to Hoto, for example, just cast Zoom. Think of Hoto and you'll be back here just like that. Right now, you've got a little beauty in your bag of tricks. Let's go find the Egdrasil branch, shall we? Galopolis is southwest of here. Okay, southwest, huh? Okay, so I gotta take a right. Still pedophilia. <laughs> Says you, Uni. Says you. I wonder if I should try to make these gals something new. Uh, forge items. I leveled up. Lightning Bash? Oh, is a softer strike made with half the normal strength. It's perfect for putting the finishing touches on more delicate items. Perfect. That's awesome. Dragon Quest is going good, Fear. I'm enjoying the heck out of it. Uh, let's see. Great swords, no. Knives, no. None of that. I need to look at armor. Shields, no. Hats. We don't have the right stuff for that. Clothes. Templar's uniform is not good at... Oh, they can't equip that? Okay. Armor, and they can't equip that either, okay? What about accessories? Rings. It actually adds defense to almost anybody, so yeah, we'll make one. What up, Noodle? How's it going, man? Okay, bash. And what if I... I mean, I'm in the green on both. Fifty-one and forty-eight. Pretty well. I'll do it. I'll just finish it. 
we'll get some pearls for it, and we'll be able to rework something. Go bring plus one. Two perfectionist pearls, perfect. Okay, rework an item. Let's see, thorn whip. A lance? What? They have some different stuff. They have different stuff. That's interesting. The adorable wind and view spellcasting stick has seen many years. Okay. A barb thong. <laughs> that can attack enemies over an extensive area. I like that. That's kind of like the boomerang, right? Um, I don't know what I'm going to use yet, so I'm going to save my pearls for now. Uh, it's kind of random. It's it's kind of a point system that it has. That's why it kind of lessens and stuff. Pretty late here, so I'm going to do some stuff before bed. Have a nice stream. Z see you soon. Later, Gladius. Thanks for hopping by, buddy. I hope you have a good rest. Good seeing you again. Okay. Equipment. Veronica. So magic might goes down. MP absorption? Oh, she absorbs MP through that. Hmm. So magic might, magic mending goes down. Her healing goes down. Hmm. It's also a two handed weapon. I mean. We'll see how she performs with it. I don't know what's going to be the right answer yet. Chain mail, can they wear either of that? No. Leather dress, they can wear that. That's pretty good. We can buy two of them. Easy. Veronica? Yes. Leather dress? Yes. Serena? Okay. Um, we already did chain mail for both of these, right? No. All right. Let's save. Welcome back, Calaraxi. Rectification, undo skill point assignments. Ooh, that's nice. That's really nice. That is cool, man. You can respec. Respecking is good. Uh, recorded your adventure. Do you plan on continuing adventure? Yes. We'll play for another little while. We at least have to try out our gals and get to the next area, right? Awake a Robin. Is this? No, I'm going the wrong way. Oh, but I can reharvest this. Nice. All of this stuff reset. That's pretty good. Okay. Straight down, yeah. Oh. Let's let's try these guys out. Uh, yes, mobs get stronger at night. Mobs get stronger at night, for sure. Drop kick! Oh my god! Kicked her in the face! Fire! I'm here to help. Oh yeah. I like that. I like it. 
Marty Hyde. Bam, 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 bam. Whoosh! Oh my god. It hurt a lot. Crack. We'll soon have that patched up. Thank you. Hundred and ten XP. These guys give a lot. <laughs> yeah, she doesn't mind casting spells, man. At all. My day's been pretty good, too. Oh, she can absorb MP when she smacks. Who else wants? Oh, Lord. Time you get off, last one. Baby girl. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. I wonder if I could just magic Serena heal. Oh, baby. Thank you. None will pass without a permit. Galopolis pass. Very well. Everything seems to be in order going through. Thank you. Oh, you should be off then. You should be off now. Oh. Oh, remember these guys from Dragon Quest? Magicians? Things up. Ouch. Ouch. Two to eleven today? Oh. Oh, uh, that is a long time. Holy crap. Shiny ones that I can steal them out from. Off on the weekends. That's pretty dad gun good, man. So you off for the weekend. Like your Friday starts at 11 p.m. tonight. I mean your Saturday. Your weekend. I oh, slapped the hell out of me. I missed him. Bruh, this is not good. Sears. Can't hit nothing. Thank you. Frizz. Dude, whatever they just cast really sucks. It's pepped up! Ouch.
I got no work this weekend, so I'm ready for some eight hour GSRP. Nice, Calyraxi. Each member receives 205 XP. Yeah, that's a sucky spell, man. Take it, Kieran. Ouch. You had to say heat things up, huh? Thank you. Ouch. Had to say, heat things up. Veronica wins again. Oh yeah. Three skill points. Uh, yeah, let's check it out. Oh man, they got twelve skill points. Allocating skill points in mass. Press X and you can choose the spells, abilities, and stat boost you'd like to learn from. Nice little list rather than selecting each individual panel individually. Oh. So, X. Oh, I see. Fierce Fred, thank you for gifting a sub to Kieran. How are you feeling today, my friend? How are you feeling today? Uh, let's see. I can get Flame Slash, but I don't want it. Oh, I see what's going on here. Boomerangs. Okay, so we can do attack power goes up or increase the chance of hitting. Let's do attack power this time. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Veronica. We'll do... Vim is increase magical might or MP absorption when wielding, okay, heavy wands, I see now, or hypno whip, the wallet with a whip on a group of enemies that can sometimes confuse them. That actually sounds like a pretty good deal, man. I think I might try out the whip on her. And see what we can do. Whip sounds fun, right? Before we donate points. A healing is definitely going to be her strong suit. Because that's what she does the best, I think. Uh, let's see. Cattle prod. A spear strike. Hem of ice. Forms a barrier that protects all party members from ice-based attacks. That's pretty nice. Um, she already knows hem of fire. Increased magical mending. Yeah. Yes. Okay, and uh, yep, not enough skill points. So we need eight points to get that going. Let's equip her with the Thorn Whip. And we'll try that out a little bit. Oh man, <laughs> that looks vicious. That looks vicious. Cotton Top, Duneberry. Why can't I get that? Oh no. It's stuck. You trash. First bug I've seen in the game. First bug I've seen. Okay, the Sultanate of Galapolis. I think I'm gonna head to that campfire though. I think the Sultanate of Galapolis will be tomorrow. I do have a little bit of... Uh, well, we're about to rest up, so we may as well. Might as well try out some stuff. Trunks from Dragon Ball Z? Yeah, a lot of people says that, Storm. A lot of people say that. It's the hairdo, I think. A lot of the characters uh, remind me of DBZ or...
might have to change up her Wonderful. type of attacks next time we fight. Okay. Well, we gotta get rid of him. Okay, tactics. Veronica. Don't fret about MP. Just give the enemy with the foot strike. Careful balance, offense, and defense. Mix it up. Keep the enemy guessing by at least a range of spells. Conserve valuable conjuring power and avoid all spells and abilities. Let's use don't use MP right now and see how she does. Ouch. Let's see this thorn whip, honey. Whop! Oh, it only hit him for one apiece? I don't know if that's gonna work out, yo. That was very lackluster. <laughs> Couldn't agree more. One and two. Wow, okay, I am level 13 now. So, <laughs> um, increase magical might. Yes, yes. Give her that back, please. Give her that weapon back right now. <laughs> that was really lackluster, man. Beast bones. That might be something new. We'll have to explore this next town we're gonna go in pretty, pretty good. Try to find some recipes and stuff. Gave a child a whip and thought it would go well. I mean, I thought it would go better than that. She talks a lot of shit. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, tactics. Veronica, fight wisely. Oh, you can make them. You can make them follow orders. You missed. Oh, you hit. See it, babe. Yeah, Android 19 and I mean Android 18? Oh no. Um No, 18 was um wasn't 18 the guy? Did I do all right? Told you I was tough. Veronica leveled up. 17. Um, Vim, she would get more MP doing this. Uh, she needs eight points to do a spooky aura. Hmm. Um, still need more to do that. Witherwood. Getting all my androids wrong? At least you didn't say CP3 C3PO. Cactors. Tactics. Show no mercy, fight wisely. Oh yeah, baby. We can auto fight. Hey, this is pretty cool, man. Calaraxi, thank you for gifting that tier one sub to Kieran. Very much appreciated. 19 was the guy. Don't 
Well, there was two guys. There was a big one and the, the guy that looked like 19. I mean, 18. Right? The one with the black hair that looked like 18 was 19. What was the, the larger one with the deeper voice? What was his name? Pipped! She said, yeah! Big one was 16? Maybe huh. it was 13? Easy. <laughs> These guys are pretty easy and they give great XP. 19! Ouch. Ouch. I'm gonna check who. <laughs> Be back in a second, all right, Kieran. And the new female? I have no idea. I haven't watched DBZ in a long time. Good job, girl. Cool it, she said. Hipped! Dude, 300 XP is crazy size. I definitely want to kill more of those things. Two more fights. And a shiny thing. Chunk of Iron Ore. She's the android with the looks of Majin Buu? Oh my. Majin Buu is something else. Big pink baby. They'll soon have that patched up. A hottie? Majin Buu? Anything that looks like Majin Buu, I have a hard time thinking that it's gonna be hot. Ooh! My boy showing off! Hey, Ninja Rabbit? Bang! Veronica got that. That juice! Ouch. 16 is the big one with 17 and 18. Ouch. You had to do it, didn't you? Just has the skin color is all? Aha. Uh -huh. So she's not pink and babyish? I mean, she's not babyish? Doesn't look anything like a giant pink baby. Ha! <laughs> that's good. <laughs> that's good to know that's comforting. Uh, the first one. Plan to continue on your adventure at this point? No. And that marks the end of Dragon Quest XI for the day. We will now be moving on to Ark.